Welcome to today's video. I am coming to pick up my mom and we are going to go on an adventure. There are some things I'm looking for. We are headed to a thrift store. It's a little bit away because we're looking at furniture today. Furniture at a thrift store. Come along with me. Mom, here's your drink. Thanks. You're welcome. Did you get me a burger also? No, I did not get you a burger. What? Do you need a burger? I need something. I brought an apple. Mom, it's one o'clock. I haven't eaten anything. I swear you're like a child. You know, I feel that I am. What's going on here? We're on a hunt. Is it that weird place that I went to one time? Probably, yeah. It's like a strange area. It's, it's, it's called Hidden Treasures? Yes. Yes, this thrift store, they have a Facebook page. Mm -hmm. And you know, I've been looking for a white buffet hutch for the kitchen for like four years. So let's just eat somewhere over in... Le oh, oh, you're gonna, you're gonna treat for a little lunchy poo? Why not? What do you want? Meat, some kind of meat. <laughs> My mom just wants the meat. <laughs> Should we call Steven and see if he wants lunch? Yes, absolutely. Let's call Steven. Hey, Steven. I don't know how to work this. What do you got? What? There's like music. What's going on? I'm here with mom. We were going to go out to lunch. You want to go? Oh, I'm tied up. I wish I could. Man, what's, what's with that and all the job stuff? What? You have to actually work? <laughs> so, thank you, guys. Okay, Bye. see ya. I created a Halloween uh, spinning playlist. Oh, cool. Thanks for lunch, Mom. You're welcome. The sun is shining too bright. The sun's burning my retinas. <laughs> and now, we thrift. I don't know that I would call it a thrift store. Would you call it uh, an upcycle? Yeah. Upcycle yeah. furniture store. We're looking for a buffet hutch for my kitchen. I know exactly what I want. I just have to find it. I did not want to spend $2,000 on one because that's essentially what it would cost to buy one new or have someone make it. We're going to go in here and see what we can see. Okay, I mean, I wasn't looking for a hot tub. I've, I've never been in this store, so. Hot tubs, I guess. My mom also said that they not only um, used stuff, but they'll get seconds. So maybe there's an imperfection or, or it didn't sell um, from furniture stores. Oh my gosh, there's, <laughs> there's hot tubs everywhere. Look at all these hot tubs. Man, this is really beautiful. Like. I don't have a TV that would fit there, but the wood is really pretty. Oh, that one. I love armoires. I just found a headboard for $10. I really love this gray headboard. It's $500. I don't have a room that would fit a bed frame because it comes out quite a bit. I have a super small room but I feel like that's a pretty good price. Wouldn't you find a price like that on Wayfair or something? As I dig through these piles of items, you know, we're here because I wanna save some money. So if you wanna save some money on things that you guys buy normally, you're gonna to wanna to check out Harry's. They are sponsoring today's video. Let me tell you about them real quick. I know you're at this video because you love saving money. I feel like saving money is top in everyone's mind right now, but there are some things you cannot completely pull back on. You need to buy groceries, need to buy toiletries, have to pay your utility bills. So it's important to find brands with the best values and Harry's is one of them. Right now, you can get Harry's starter set for just $5 plus you'll get a free travel size body wash. That is a $16 value for just $5. Bucks. Just visit harrys.com slash FFM. That is the first link down in the doobly-doo below. You don't want to overpay for razors with gimmicks. Stick with cheap razors that don't do the job. So Harry's was created to give you both a great quality at a great value. The trial set is only $5 and the blade refill is as low as two bucks each. The starter set includes five blade German engineered razor, weighted handle, foaming shave gel, and a travel cover. And for the first 1,000 customers, you will get a free travel size body wash. That's a $16 value for just $5. Just visit harrys.com slash FFM. Look at these old Coca-Cola bottles. Like, I think these are super cool. 
they're four dollars each i don't know what i would do with them this is why a place like this is like almost doesn't feel like my place because i think something's cool but i don't know what you do with it okay i just spent a few minutes talking to the owner manager so factory seconds they'll buy uh hotels when hotels like redo stuff they'll buy entire households when someone passes like an estate situation look at this mirror 50 percent off so oh it's 300 that feels like a lot but to be fair i don't know what things are supposed to cost like i don't know what things like this stuff normally cost so i'm just <laughs> i'm just throwing out numbers like an idiot right i found this um buffet it's obviously like a weathered gray it's 50% off. Even with the 50% off, it's still $700. And I paid a lot less than that for my media cabinet in the basement. Okay, this industrial coffee table is so cool. Look at this. It's like metal and blue wood. It's $199, $199. Is that a good price? I would say the prices are super hit and miss. I, some things I think are really great and some I feel like are a lot for a discount furniture store. Look at this bookshelf. I'm dying, it's gorgeous. No price tag. That is solid wood. That kind of piece, if I had like ceilings big enough, I'd be, be all over that. It's just really stunning. I love the deep, dark, rich woods. I just think they're really beautiful. I, I cannot believe how many hot tubs they have here. Okay, when the day comes for me to buy a hot tub, I'm coming here. I'm still looking for the buffet that I saw online and I have not stumbled across it yet. Uh, yes, would you uh, bring the car around? Um, if you need a whale rug, give this video a thumbs up. I found it. This is the nap couch. This couch is $4.99. I can barely find a couch that cheap on the Facebook marketplace. This feels like a bed. I'm pretty sure I need this couch in my house. You just take a nap in the living room. I'm telling you, Restoration Hardware makes a couch just like this for thousands and thousands of dollars. My mom is buying something and then we'll go to the other showroom, which is where like the rest of the hutches are. So we'll, we'll go over there in just a second. I didn't realize I had a whole second building. So I found one. It's on clearance for $4,500. That's the look, mom. Yeah. Yeah. This is spectacular. It's a hundred inches long, which is huge, which is perfect. This is what's not perfect. So let me ask you, am I crazy? Am I being really, really picky because I don't wanna pay this much? Because let me tell you, I've been looking on Facebook Marketplace for two years to find something that's older. I'll paint it myself, used or at a different furniture store. I've gone to an estate sale. I don't think I'm willing to pay 300, 300. I'm willing to pay 300. I'm not willing to pay 3,000 and I'm definitely not willing to pay 4,600 for that one. Wow. I don't know how I got here. This is not where I belong. I feel very out of place. Lamps make me nervous. I don't like here? them. Don't know what to do with them. They're just clutter. Lamps are just surface clutter. I need to leave. You don't really have any lamps in your house. No, I don't. Really? Okay, well, there's several reasons. The reasons are threefold. This lamp is on clearance for $150. This one right here? That one right there. Do you know how many pairs of shoes I could buy with that? Well, how about this dust collector right there for only $49? That one? Yeah. Yeah. Look, that just looks like more work for me. <laughs> more cleaning, more dusting. And because I don't dust at all, that, that would really be a jump into a person that I am not. How do you pick a style? Where do you put them? Oh, end tables don't have those either. So <laughs> we're really out of luck. You could say we're SOL, my friends. What is it? Oh, it's a vase. Uh, a what? Mirror frame with vase. How? You put, I don't understand things like this. That is the best dust collector I've seen. Could you imagine how dirty these would get? That's what, that's what I think when I look at this. This is pretty cool. You know what's not cool? Is that. Yeah, that's great. I, I feel like. There's not even any knobs here. Oh, the knobs broke off. Maybe they'll give you 10% off. Beginning to think this is not my store and we need to go to like an estate sale or something. This is the, the furniture thrift for today. 
is a fail. Okay, mom got the deal of the day, which is this $29 solid wood table. She wants to put it in her library area for kids to play games. Grandkids come to visit all the time, not just my kids, but uh, my nieces and nephews go all the time. It's a little dirty, but nothing a little elbow grease will not fix up. She found some success today and I did not. So I will just drink my Maverick drink and keep the hunt alive for the buffet hutch for my kitchen. I don't know where we're gonna find it, guys. I don't know how long it's gonna take but we will find it. I probably should have started here, but this is, this is the area. What? This is the area I'm trying to find that buffet for. This one is just too small for the space and what I need it for. I wanna move my everyday dishes over here so the kids can get things easier. I need something that's a little bit bigger than this. I have this entire wall. Oh no, oh, okay. She thinks we're playing. It's like 130 inches long. And if I had something that was white, instead of this uh, wood color, it would brighten up the space a little bit. That's the goal. I've been looking for years at this point. Still can't find anything. I'm willing to paint something, not with chalk paint. That's no fun. <laughs> no, I can totally see you. Of course, I walk away from the thrift store with nothing and my mom finds two things to buy. But anyway, thanks for hanging out with me. I'll see you next video, bye.